today we will learn how to create a part chart or diagram from a table of activities here we can see a table of activities and there are activities a b c d e f g so there are a total of eight activities and from the table we can see the number of days required to complete these tasks and the preceding activities are also given to draw the part chart or diagram at first we need to create a node let us create a node this node will be representing the starting of the diagram and we will assign arrows based on the activity and the number of days required so here is the first node one for starting point we can see that there is no prerequisite for activity a and b so we can assign to arrow from node one first arrow represent activity a with three days and the second arrow will represent tux b which requires two days then we will create two nodes representing the ending of activity a and b next we observe that the tux c d e have activity a as prerequisite so we will create three arrows representing these three activities from node 2 again we will have three ending nodes here note that c activity have a ending node 3 right why it is because we can see from the table that f have two preceding activities that are b and c so we will start f from here so these preceding activities must be completed to start the activity f here is the activity d and here is the activity e then we can assign arrows for activity F and G. F and G. Then finally, the activity H we have prerequisite D, E and F. D, E and F. So, here will be H activity but here we can see that D is the prerequisite of H but there is no connection so we can give a dummy activity with no duration connection arrow this represents the dummy activity from node 4 to 5 because we have a prerequisite of tux D to start the tux H. So here it is the part chart we have drawn from the table of activities.